and so today I am here with a really exciting announcement. The past couple of months I decided to make a Goodreads group for readathons for this summer. I will link it down below, but basically on this group page we all kind of get together, vote on polls and stuff, and make up readathons for the four-ish months of the summer. We've already decided on our May, June, and I think maybe July? but you guys can still totally jump in and vote on August um, and we basically just come up with readathons and they're basically just really chill weeks of reading a certain type or genre of book um, and our May one is going to be our first one and that is non-fiction reads. This readathon will be running from May 21st to May 27th and there are no challenges, no rules, except for the fact that you need to read non-fiction books. You don't even necessarily need to read only non-fiction books, like if you're reading another book and are like, ooh, I need to finish this beforehand, read that. Basically this is just to make you inspired to read non-fiction books. And I personally have a bunch of non-fiction books piled up um, on my TBR that I just really need to read, so I plan on binge reading all of those during this week. So today, besides the announcement video for this Goodreads group for you guys to join and this readathon for you guys to join, I will also be showing you guys my TBR. You see that entire shelf just like go to shit because I took so many books off? Because I did. Okay, so I have three books and if I finish those three books I have a fourth book to add um, and yes all of these are nonfiction obviously. So the first book that I have is the one that's been on my TBR the longest and I've definitely showed it a couple of times and that is The Red Market by Scott Carney. This is a journalist who wrote about his basically research and kind of investigation into the black market for human organs um, and I thought that sounds really really amazing. I think that's just like a really interesting topic and a really interesting thing that is kind of prevalent. Um, so yeah, this is my first read. My next read is kind of a sneak peek into a my upcoming book haul, but that is uh, J.R.R. Tolkien's biography by Humphrey Carpenter. Uh, I picked this up on a whim just because I love J.R.R. Tolkien and basically I'm a sucker for anything he's written or um, is about him. So I've never actually read anything of his biographies or autobiographies or like actually I really don't know that much about him in general except for his works that he's made so I would really love to just kind of fly through this one and kind of learn about my favorite author, you know? That'd be cool. Um, the next book that I have is Oliver Sacks' The Mind's Eye. Um, this is the author of The Man Who Mistook His Wife for a Hat. Um, Oliver Sacks, basically my friend at college, like, talked about him all the time because of a podcast that talks about him, I believe. Um, and I was at the bookstore and this was in the bargain section. And I was like, Oliver Sacks, I know that name. So I decided to pick it up. Um, and basically he just writes books all about psychology and, like, human psychology and different cases that happen in that realm. Um, and the next book that I also have, if I finish all of these books, is another one of his books, which is Seeing Voices, and this is about the deaf community. I honestly might read this one before this one, but we'll see. Um, and yes, so just two psychology books by Oliver Sacks. I believe they're both like under, they're just both barely 200 pages. So um, I would really like to try these out, and because he has so many different books, and if I like them, I can pick up more by him. But yes, this is my TBR for this readathon. Please post down below what you guys are planning on reading if you're going to participate um, or make a video of response. That'd be really, really cool. Um, and make sure to join the group to be able to vote on when we have our readathons and what our readathons are about. But yeah, that is my TBR for this readathon. I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. I hope you guys all join us for the nonfiction readathon. And I love you all, and I'll see you all soon. Bye!